Welcome to this channel. In this video, I will show you exactly why you have the problem of Facebook ad running. It, it is showing that it is running, but it's not actually spending the money. So for example, as you can see on this screen, this particular ad campaign is active. It's showing active. But if you come to the results column, you see that the results is dash. You see that um, the reach is dash. Impressions, nothing is showing that it is running. So the result is showing uh, is showing that it is not actually running, but you actually see that it is written that it's active, which means it is running. And then normally, maybe you see that it's active for at least a day or more or some hours, and you see that no, something is definitely wrong. So I will show you why this particular uh, problem happens. There are four reasons why it happens. So these are the four reasons. The number one reason is that you have temporary hold on successful. So if you want to know whether there is temporary hold on successful or not, you come to this place, you see billing and payment, you open it in a new tab. So this is it. So if you come here, you will see here, it normally will write here that temporary hold on successful. We were not able to place a temporary hold on your payment method to add a new payment method and try again. So what it means is that they are trying to let you know that they wanted to check and see if you have enough money in your payment method or your debit card and they check and there was no enough money. So that is why they stopped it. So what you have to do in that particular case is that you have to scroll down and then see when you scroll down and you go to payment activity, normally you will see an, an, a certain amount they tried to charge and it failed. Yes, when you check another payment activity, you see a certain amount they were trying to charge and it failed. So what it definitely means is that uh, they wanted to check whether you have that up to that particular amount on your debit card and it failed. So you have to top up your debit card to have up to that money. And when you come, you will see try hole again. So you click on the try hole again. If you if you try that and it still doesn't go, and I'm sure if you have enough money, it when you try the hole again, the temporary hole will be approved. Okay. If you try that hole again and it doesn't approve, I did a video specifically for how to solve the temporary hole problem. Okay. So you can check the link above. Follow it. That video is more detailed. That can help you and um, be able to solve the temporary hold problem. I will also leave the link to that video in the description. You can also create a new ad account, and I will leave all of that those videos in the description. That's the first reason why it happens. But I am sure if you have enough money in your debit card and try the hold again, it will be resolved. Now that's the first reason. Let's go to the second one. The second reason is that your budget is too small. So how do you solve that problem? You come to your ad campaign, click on the edit. It will open. Then you go to the ad set and uh, what do you call it? Normally, some of you, if you are boosting directly from your phone, you might have done, you might have boost a post. You might have done, uh, what do we call it? Uh, you boosted an, an existing post. So in that case, you have to come and check. Normally, if you boost an existing post, the, the, the budget will be showing under the campaign um, level. It will show under the campaign level because it will be using campaign budget optimization. However, if you set up in the ad manager, if you set the advert up in the ad manager, the budget will normally be at the um the ad set level. So under the ad set level, when you scroll down, you will see your budget per day. And let me be more specific here. You see, if you are targeting countries, first world countries like the US, UK, uh, Canada, Australia, please, the budget, the CPM, which is the, the, the budget, the amount you can use to reach 1,000 people is $20 and above. And any advert that will not reach up to 1,000 people per day will not bring you any significant results. It means the budget will be too small. So if you are targeting first world countries like the United States, the United Kingdom, uh, Australia, make sure that your budget per day is at least $20. If your budget is less than $20 a day, it will not work. The advert will not um, give it, it will not give you significant results. So it's small budget is one of the problems. If your budget is not small or if small budget is not a problem, and I'm not saying that all countries of the world, if your budget is less than $20 a day is too small, no. I mean, those advanced countries, they are, their CPM is high. Germany, United Kingdom, United States, um australia canada these are the countries that their cpm are high not only those countries there are more countries with higher cpms but if you are targeting a country like india normally their cpm is lower a country like nigeria 
a country like Ghana, a country like South Africa, comparatively, their CPMs are lower. I hope you get me. Okay, so you scroll down. If your budget is not small or if the small budget is not what your problem is, or if you suspect that, no, your budget is okay, then scroll down and go to um, the audience. If you check the audience and your audience size is less than a million people, then your audience is too small. Make sure that your audience size is at least 1 million. In fact, if it is less than 100,000, then you won't even get any results at all. So I will advise you that no matter what the problem is, make sure you increase the size of your audience to at least 1 million and you will see a better result. That is the third reason. So that one, how you just come and click on edit. Then you have to go to normally the locations, add more locations. Or sometimes it could be that you added just a few detailed targeted terms that has limited it to only some few people. So you, if that that is the cause of your small audience, your small audience size, you can delete some of the detailed targeting terms. Okay. Then if the small, if your audience is not less than one million, then it is not the audience problem. So it's, let's go to the next one. You go to the the placement. Under the placement, some of you will go and choose man when you are posting direct from the page uh, from the page. Yes. Sometimes the problem is that it will select just one placement and it can select only Facebook Rails. It will leave all the other placements like Facebook feed, which are the highest number of people. So you have to come to your man, you have to come to the manual placement, then you select placement. So as you can see here, here I can see that it has removed the advert is only under it's only Facebook Rails that has been targeted here. So Facebook feed is removed. Can you see that Facebook feed is moved? So I have to, in, I am including Facebook feed. I'm including Instagram feed, I'm in, in, Instagram feed, Instagram profile feed, and I'm in, in, including all that. Then uh, marketplace and then um, video feed. These are all effective placement, but I don't know what happened. They have all been removed automatically. So sometimes maybe if the audience you have selected uh, the placement you've selected is too small. Just make the changes and publish it. If you publish it, it is likely to improve upon the performance of your advert. If you follow these four steps, you are definitely going to get a solution to your ad campaign not running effectively. It will actually run. Okay. Now, if you follow these four procedures and you still don't get a solution, this is what you should do. You should follow the link. There is a Telegram and WhatsApp link in the description of this video. Follow it to WhatsApp us. We will help you get very effective results for your ad campaigns. We actually run advert and we've been doing that for people across the whole world and our charges are affordable and we will give you effective results. Thank you once again for watching. Remember to subscribe to this channel, turn on the notification bell and like this video for other more powerful videos like this. Once again, see you in the next video. Bye-bye.